channel, me and Car Keep. See, I was trying to beat the sun up, but uh, the sun beat me up anyway. But speaking of the sun, we're talking about lighting today. So we are almost fully LED on this truck from front to back, but I want to do a walk around quick and show you what all we did. All the bulbs we're going to talk about are all Alvito LED light bulbs, and they can all be found in the description below. So let's start in the front. So up front we have the Alpharex Pro Series projectors in matte black. I don't know if you can see that in there, but these are matte black housings. Now when you unlock the truck, get that nice startup sequence. Now that's part of the reason why I bought these lights over some of the other brands that were out. Love that startup sequence. So if you look inside, let me put the lights on for you. So these are our H7 bulbs, these are the low beams here. These are the high beams down here. They are both H7 bulbs. I got them both from Oxido.com. And now these fit uh, a lot of aftermarket applications. So Alpha Rex, I know they fit Anzos as well. So a lot of aftermarket companies use H7 bulbs. So if they came with an H7 halogen bulb, you can take it out and put an H7 LED bulb, which is what I did. Link in the description. Uh, if you wanna see a video on that, I also linked that one uh, to where I put the LED bulbs in these Alpha Rex housings. Coming down here, you have your fog lights. And this is one of the first LEDs that I changed. I put the fog lights down here. They are super bright, probably the brightest um, fog light I've ever seen. <laughs> now, super bright. So be a little careful with these because these housings are not, um, these are not projector housings. These are the stock housings. If you look at the angle of lighting, fog lights are down low so they can cut under the fog, right? So. Even though they're super bright, they shouldn't blind people because they are up under the fog. Uh, low beams are supposed to be low, um, mostly mid-range. I know it's uh, backwards. My low beams are at the top, my high beams are at the bottom. But the low beams shoot straight in front of you. High beams shoot up and down in every direction, pretty much. I want to quickly point out this is the beam pattern for the low beams. Now the low beams are here at the top, and they are protectors. They do have this cut off. are the high beams. High beams do shoot in every direction and they are super bright. They are down here at the bottom. Now still in the front here, these are marker lights. They are also LEDs. Here you have your turn signals. I have not changed out these. These are still the halogen zone if you see that in there. That is still a halogen bulb. The reason I bought these Alpha Rex Pro Series headlights is because of number one, the projector. Number two, the startup sequence. Number three, this daytime running light here that is also a sequential turn signal when you uh, turn signals. So moving right along in the front, you also have LEDs here in the grill, uh, marker lights. Now these came with the grill, I did not change them. They are, this is how they came. I got this grill off of eBay. Uh, you know, you can find Raptor grills pretty much anywhere now. So moving right along to the back of the truck here. First thing we changed back here was these License plate lights. Now they came with ugly halogen lights. They were very dull, you could barely see them. So we switched these out to LEDs, also by Xedo. Uh Coming around along here, we have marker lights. I got these off of Amazon. We also added extra reverse lights. Now, I didn't need these, right? At the time I did, uh, it was hard to see in the camera. So I added these for a little extra lighting. But if you look in here, I did change out my reverse lights. These are also Xedo LEDs. Link will be in the description. These are super, super bright. So bright that I didn't actually need this anymore. But you know, the more light, the better. Uh, if you look in here, our brake light slash turn signal is still a halogen bulb. I have not changed that out. Um, I was also worried about hyper flash, but I do have plans to change these out to LEDs at some point. Now, as far as these go, you couldn't change these out, right? They're super bright, super white. You couldn't change those out without changing out your third brake light. All right, these are also LEDs. Now, perfect about these is they match the license plate lights perfectly. Same color, bright white. And they also give better visibility when you're trying to look through your cargo bed and you just need a little lighting at nighttime. Now in the middle here is our brake light, third brake light. I have not changed that one as well. Um, it would have made sense to change them all at the same time, but I did not. So <laughs> that's another thing that's on my list of to do things as far as LED bulbs go. But like I said, what I like about those is they give you 
a crisp white light and they also match your LED bulbs down here perfectly. Now if you open up, I do have these as well. These are LEDs, actually came with LEDs in here. I have not changed them. There you go. I rarely use them uh, unless I'm really back here and it's really dark, I can't see anything. But there's one on that side and there's also one on that side. So these are the stock interior lights. They are LEDs, which is kind of surprising that they put LEDs on the inside, but nowhere else. Now, if you need to replace one of these, or if yours didn't come with LEDs, you can buy these as well off of Auxito.com. Um, I have not changed mine out yet. Um, I'm gonna wait until they actually go out to change if them. If you're gonna change out LED bulbs, and you plan on maybe you plan on changing like several different, different applications, stick to one brand, all right? I always stick to one brand. Uh, when you get different brands, you're just getting different colors of white lighting, right? So LEDs have different uh, temperature ratings, right? So even though they have different temperature ratings, uh, two different companies' idea of a temperature rating may be different. So you may get one company has bright lights and it might be a, one color of white. You see, might see another company, and you put them in, they might be a different color white. All right, I've seen it several times. I've actually done it, which is why I'm saying it. I got two different brands. I had one up here in the third brake light. I had one down there in the license plate light. They both said super white. They were the same temperature rating, but when I put them in, they were different colors and it looked really weird. What's good about Oxido is that they do everything for you, right? They are a big light, light bulb company, primarily LED light bulbs, and they do everything for you. So you can go on the website, you can put in your, your vehicle information and it will give you a list of light bulbs that fit your application. Like a lot of times you go and you look for light bulbs and they're confusing. They're different types that fit different applications and they're different types of each bulb and it just gets to, to be too much a lot of times. So they made it easy for you. All you do is go on the website, you put in your vehicle and it'll show you all the bulbs that fit your vehicle. What's also good is that they will, you can buy it in a bundle package, right? They'll give you a bundle package of all the bulbs you need to buy them all together. And I believe it saves you a little bit of money if you actually buy them in a bundle package versus buying each one separately. Now you can still buy them separately, but it would be helpful to just buy the whole bundle and then you can put it in whenever you get ready. If you do decide to buy something off auxito.com, make sure you use my code, me and car keys at checkout. It will save you 15% off your order, save you just a little bit of money. It makes a big difference when you see that come, when you see that discount come off the total. So don't forget to use that, uh, save you a little bit of money. And it also helps me out, helps me grow the channel as well. Um, I do have a long partnership with Auxito. Um, they, like I said, they have sponsored several videos on this truck. I do also have installed videos uh, for most of the light bulb applications on this truck. I will leave them in the description as well. Uh, just help you out just a little bit. Most of them are very easy. Unscrew, screw them back in. Need any information as well, feel free to ask me in the comments. I'm always here to help. Uh, thank you for watching another video on me and Crikey's channel. Till next time, thanks for watching.